YouTube Nation, you know it. It's for your success. Say it with me, your favorite hiking professor, Dr. Brandon Four. Early in the morning, Yankee Boy Basin. On my way to Mount Sneffels. This is just outside of Ure in Telluride, Colorado. Clear skies, light winds, no chance of precip today, but lots of smoke. Don't you dare pick any flowers, but go ahead and shoot the sign. So we're headed to the Mount Snuffles Trail. That's 1.8 miles from here. So straight out in front of you, right there, that's Snuffles. I'm above 12 right now. You can actually see the upper four-wheel drive trailhead. That's 12,460. Once we get past that, it'll take us alongside Sneffels and then it's straight up class three. They're coming up in style. That's what happens when you collect social security. I'm young enough to enjoy the hike. Maybe I'll buy one of those when I'm older. There's a map here. I want to point this out. Less than a mile to the summit and 1,700 feet of elevation gain. That doesn't really tell you much, does it? You are here. This is where you're going. It's going to be steep. <laughs> Here's some fun stats for you. It can get cold. It can get windy. Wear sunblock. It's quite steep, but not as bad as I thought it would be. So I'm above 13, just making my way through this. This is when a lot of people are like, oh God, I need a breather. I'm tired. And this is what training gets you a good pace and a mental mindset. I thrive in moments like this because it focuses me and mentally I'm only thinking positive things. Specifically, I'm in my moment. This is what it's all about. And I love this. For some people, it's about the summits. For me, it's the hard stuff. I have reached the ridge at 13.5. It is now 600 feet through that ravine and more to go. Hard to videotape and good to good grip. I can tell you it's quite steep.
Oh my goodness. Wow. The top of a smoky Mount Snuffles. 14,150 feet from the lower trailhead, Yankee Boy Basin. Took me two hours and 10 minutes to summit today. These fires are summer in Colorado, but a lot of this smoke is from those devastating fires in California. So right down there is the saddle, and you can't see the ravine that you come up, but you can see the ridge and the trail, taking you all the way to the upper two-wheel drive or upper four-wheel drive trailhead, and then they're out back down. Ah, well, I am at the summit of Sneffels, and let me tell you, when you're driving towards Telluride, and you look at Mount Sneffels, you are so impressed at the size and behemoth of this mountain. And all this smoke feels like it deteriorates from the accomplishment a little bit. But nonetheless, it's a wonderful summit. And even though it said it's class three, there's a couple of class three moves. Everything else is probably an easy class three. And I can tell you it ain't no Blanca. <laughs> but just barely over two hours to summit. As I was coming up on the ridge, there was quite a few hikers. Somebody said to me, are you a Sherpa? <laughs> I was like, that's a great compliment, but I am not. I'm just Brandon. And so, and if you see me hiking, I'm just going to introduce myself as Brandon. I'm not going to be like, hey, I'm for your success. I'm, I'm not that guy. So, I'm just thrilled to share this with you. What an incredible day. So, that's the way down. You can see some hikers coming up. And that is steep, let me tell you. So, this was really one of the tougher spots. Kind of had to grab a couple of spots right here to get up. And that's what makes this hike a class three. The route up. Yankee Boy Basin. All finished. I basically ran from the four-wheel drive trailhead down, past a lot of Jeeps. Always great when you're faster than a Rubicon, because it's kind of a rough four-wheel drive, but what a great hike. I know it's smoky, but Snuffles is really an elegant 14er just outside of Uray and Telluride. So glad I could share it with you. And how about you share it with friends and family? Because guess what? This is 14 or number 80. I can't believe it. I'm truly blessed to be able to do these things and to be in such shape to be able to share it with you. Believe me, I really appreciate it. And I also really appreciate all the kind posts. Almost everybody sends nice messages. I've gotten great comments about how I've, many of you have gotten back into hiking or you've lost weight and that's what this is all about just for you to say you know I, I really miss doing that or I want to try it and experience it just remember you got to love the uphill part to really appreciate the summit so for the last time here Yankee Boy Basin I'm for your success you your favorite hiking professor sorry Dr. Brandon Four. On to the next one. Enjoy this video. Thank you so much. I'll see you and you take care.